Hello, this is Pastor Gene Kim from San Jose Bible Baptist Church. So I know there's a lot of people out there who are seeking for Bible-believing truth materials online. So I finally decided to introduce to you a lot of Bible-believing sites that you can turn to that can help you with your walk, especially a lot of these are great men of God, preachers and resources and ministries that are underestimated, that are overlooked, and they're not receiving enough attention that they deserve. So what I'm going to do is introduce to you a lot of these Bible-believing preachers, ministries, and websites that will be an incredible blessing to you. And I hope that you will please subscribe to them, give them a call, email them as an encouragement that they are being watched, that you're learning a lot from them. And so if you would do that, I'd surely appreciate it. Now, before I introduce these Bible-believing sites, I also want to mention this, is that the reason why I would not mention certain other Bible-believing sites that other people might recommend is because based on a couple things, is that one, the Bible-believing or so-called Bible-believing site that the people would recommend is actually not genuinely Bible-believing like we are. So maybe they, maybe they do not believe that the King James Bible is the perfect, pure Word of God, or maybe they're not dispensationally as strong as we are. Or maybe they went through some kind of problems or disagreements with our kind of Bible-believing crowd. So if there is a disagreement or a controversy that they went through with our Bible-believing crowd, then that's the reason why that I did not recommend these people because they used to be one of us but then they had a controversy or a disagreement out of pride so because they had pride issues that's the reason why we don't affiliate ourselves with them so I don't recommend those ministries another reason why I would not recommend them is because I probably don't know who they are so I might know them but I don't know them personally now unless I know that the Bible believing minister and the ministry is in line with us they don't say anything like well I disagree with for example Dr. Peter S. Peter S. Ruckman on this or on that or they'll name another Bible believing preacher when I hear that it's a red flag to me because it's not because that those Bible believing ministers are important or that they're infallible but rather that the person is disagreeing with that Bible believing minister out of pride because they don't know much of the Bible yet because these Bible believing ministers you gotta understand have been in the ministries for years God has mightily used them they studied so much of that book so because of that when a person said well I disagree with and they named the Bible believing minister I disagree with so-and-so out there then I see that as a sign of pride or as a sign that the person hasn't studied enough now don't get me wrong, Bible-believing ministers disagree with each other. Uh, you're going to find differences, especially with me. But the thing is that what shows humility to me is that the person does not point out the disagreement, but rather that the person keeps his mouth shut and let the Holy Spirit show him or her more in time. Okay, I apologize for that background noise if you hear it back there. It's that, that dumb air vent that's going on. But aside from that, what shows a sign of humility is that the person does not point out the disagreement, but rather tries to find something that they agree with. Because Paul said in the Word of God, who is Apollos, or who is Paul, or I am of Cephas. The point is, is not to point out the different crowds and movements, but rather that we're all united. Paul specified that we're, also, we're all supposed to be united, one in the Spirit. So, the person online may be a Bible-believing minister like us, but... I may not know really much about the person that I can fully confidently recommend them that they are one of us because maybe they said that they disagreed with so-and-so on something but that's also the reason why like I mentioned at the beginning I would not recommend certain Bible believing ministers because they did disagree with us on something and even went through a split or a controversy because they had pride issues so uh, the last reason that I did not recommend some of these other Bible-believing websites is because the person already has a large influence of a Bible-believing ministry on the Internet, so which is why we don't recommend them. What I'm going to try to recommend to you are, one, the ones that are the most important, and two, the ones that are underestimated. 
They don't receive enough significant attention that they deserve. So, based on these reasons, I hope that people don't misunderstand, misunderstand why I did not recommend certain Bible-believing websites. Again, it's based on, one, because they are one of us, but because out of pride issues, they had some disagreements or controversies. That's why they're not affiliated with us. Two, I don't really know the website or the person that well if they're truly united with us, which is why I don't recommend them. Three, they are one of us and they teach like we do, but the thing is is that they already have a widespread influence. So I'm trying to recommend those that don't have much of a much of a ten attention that they deserve. Now I'm only going to recommend the ones that are the most significant and the ones that are the underestimated. Okay, with all that said and done, I hope you understand. Let me go through all these websites one by one. Okay, the first thing is bbcenglish.org. That is our website. So you'll notice this page right here. Let me type it again, bbcenglish.org. So bbcenglish.org. Once you go in there, then you'll see our website here. Now, the reason why I recommend our website is not because we're the greatest, we're the bomb. The reason why I started that way is because this is important, resources. So please click on resources. And when you click on resources, it's going to give you all the instructions that you need to know. So if you got saved or you're introduced to Bible Believing Truth from our website, please read the instructions and it will give you everything that you need to know. It also gives you a video on how to get saved if you're not saved yet, if you're new to our channel. And it will also give you a, a montage of clips at the end of all the Bible Believing ministers that are affiliated with us. Now if you keep going down, you guys are looking for a Bible believing church near you. Now if you're in the United States, this is the link that you want to click. If you're in foreign countries, you need to email me. Now my email address can be found right here. So if you go to our website, go to contact us. Once you click on contact us, okay, you're going to have to ignore this part. But once you click contact us, you'll see right here, see our information. Now this is our sister church right here but this is our church right here the address is located here and for those of you who are mailing you want to mail here please do not mail here this is just our location this is where you want to mail and then uh, this is if you want to donate you can click on that one like I said in this instruction here we do not believe in asking donations but there are people who really want to donate to us so just click on that one and you can do it but here's our contact email all right, contact me here if you're in a foreign country and you need a Bible-believing ministry to go to. Now, aside from that, as we go back to our page right here on our resources link, you'll notice click here to find Bible-believing churches and materials in foreign languages. So we don't have much right here, but you can click on that and it will have your country language of the ministry and the website that you'll need. This one has dispensationalism. This one has the King James Bible issue. Now we stand strongly on these two issues, so I recommend for you to click on them and watch. This one we recommend every person to get the Ruckman Reference Bible, and there's a cheap one for only $25. This is where I get 90% of my teachings from. This one teaches you how to do soul winning. If you want to learn how to do street preaching, click on this one. Uh, click on this one if you want to learn how to debate, uh, defend the truth against many different cults, religions, atheism, evolution, etc. Click here if you want to order tracts to pass out. If you want different Bible-believing books, tapes, materials, CDs, tapes. <laughs> tapes are non-existent. But anyway, videos. Oop, where did this come from? Okay. Anyway, materials and all that, then just click on this one. If you want to click on different Bible-believing preachers to listen to besides me, it's here. Different Bible-believing radio stations, 24-7. Click here. Some of you have asked for a Bible-believing uh, institute to go to. You can click on this one. But you've got to make sure that you go by their terms and their rules if you want to qualify into their institute. And then those of you who want to study under me, it's you have to go to our discipleship videos. Now, to go to our discipleship videos, what I'm going to have to do is get to our channel here real quickly. So let me type down here. Uh, BBC International BBC International YouTube if you want to study in our church and in our ministry I opened up discipleship videos they go 
and you'll see them every week almost. Click on playlist. Once you're in our channel, click on playlist. And when you're on playlist, click in created playlist. When you're in created playlist, scroll down and you'll find discipleship. Once you click on discipleship, you have all the classes right here that you can watch. Okay? These are all the discipleship videos. Okay, now, uh, now that we got that out of the way concerning our website, uh, I believe that was everything. This is everything you need, so I strongly recommend go to our website right here. That way you can have all the Bible-believing resources in here. This is why I start out with our website. Okay, now the different Bible-believing ministries and websites we'd recommend. The, one is Time for Truth UK. Now, I recommend going to his website right here, too. I mean, he's got a lot of good materials. He is one of us, and he sells materials. He has his own bookstore. He's got the best tracks, evangel evangelistic resources to pass out. I mean, this man, he preaches the whole truth, nothing but the truth. And please, you know, you can go to his website, support him, comment on him. He's got great YouTube videos. He's in England. Uh, the other one is Jack Crailer, Jack and Sandy Crailer. You'll notice street preaching videos. Now, there's a lot of street preaching videos on YouTube, but you got to understand this. There are a lot, a majority of them, if not all of them, are heretics. They either teach uh, eradication of the flesh or lordship salvation. They also use, uh, use shock tactics, acting like a jerk, to try to gain attention from people. That's not how it should be. They're also rebels. They don't go to a Bible-believing church. So Jack Crailer is the best one that I'd recommend for you to turn to for street preaching. He's got a lot of street preaching tips and advice. Please watch his videos. You'll get a blessing out of that. And also encourage him if you can. The other one is Banners Unfurled. They, once a year, they have a thing called the Beale Street Blast. In this Beale Street Blast, they get together and get all kinds of different Bible-believing preachers. And then uh, with these Bible-believing preachers, they're going to train men on how to exactly do street preaching. So they got a lot of stuff right here. Now, there's probably like one or a few guest speakers in this video that I don't really affiliate myself with. But the man in charge and their ministry in general, Banners Unfurled, we definitely and strongly recommend them. They're one of us. They're Bible believers. They teach you how to do street preaching the right way, not the wrong way, not with shock tactics or with eradication of flesh, lordship salvation heresies. But Banners Unfurled, they have Bill Street Blast meetings once a year at Tennessee at Bill Street. I recommend for you guys to go over there if you're nearby at Tennessee and then see what they do. Look at all these banners. They're great people. Led by Ken Lansing, I believe. This one is a German YouTube station. So if you guys want, if you guys are in Germany and you want Bible-believing German materials, this is your channel right here. So I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, Biber, Baptisten Gemeinde. <laughs> but Dr. Nico Veroff, he is one of the ten, or one of the three that is publicly known, who received their doctorate degrees from Dr. Peter S. Ruckman himself. So we strongly recommend him as well. The other one, this is a Spanish ministry. Now, unfortunately, they have not been going for a long time. Now, this was used to be led by Dr. Jeff McArdle, but sadly he passed away. Dr. Mike Castro, he's the one that has started to run things a little more. And then Phil, Missionary Philip Robinson, he's the one who's probably the more predominant uh, movement among Spanish Bible believers. But this is their YouTube channel that I can recommend. Uh, as far as contacting one of those Spanish Bible believing ministers, Please look at our resources link. Again, in our resources link, click on, click here for foreign languages. When you click on that, you'll see one in Spanish. Click on Spanish, boom, you'll see missionary Philip Robinson right there. And then you can be in touch with him. So this is a Spanish Bible believing YouTube channel. This one is Anchor Baptist Church by Pastor Mike Elliott. I've seen him a few times, especially at Dr. David Peacock's KJV Jubilee, that was a big blessing. If you want to hear a wild preacher, this man's a wild preacher. He used to be part of the Navy, and uh, this man, he is quite a character. He's funny, he's wild, he's got great preaching, no holds bar, right in your face. So this is Anchor Baptist Church, led by Pastor Mike Elliott at Ohio. 
This one is, I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, Visachi Avenue Baptist Church. This is led by Pastor Bez Cummings right here. So this is his YouTube channel, and he's a Bible-believing minister like us. Another ministry that I'd recommend is Bible Believers Ministries India. So Lord bless his heart, he's been doing these kind of whiteboard drawings like I am. So he's very intelligent. He does it very clearly. Uh, the quality is way better than our videos, actually. He actually plays our videos in India, in TV. TV. So God bless this preacher's heart. If you can also support him. He's got a lot more views compared to other, other Bible-believing ministers that I recommended so far. But if you can go over there, encourage him, and be a blessing to him, that'd be an incredible, nice thing for you guys to do. As I continue on over here, the next YouTube channel is New Heights Baptist Church. That's by Pastor Adrian Dominguez. So Pastor Adrian Dominguez, he used to be a missionary, uh, but he became a pastor now in Colorado. So he's a Bible-believing pastor. I'd hope that you support him as well. I know I had a PBI friend who graduated the same year as me, Brother St. John, and he went over there. And I know a couple friends over there as well. Next one is Pastor Randy Gorski from AV King James Baptist Church. This man, he does a lot of street preaching ministry, and his preaching is like right in your face. So he's actually a very close friend of mine. Uh, his family went through the Holocaust at Poland, so he's a Jew. And But him and his Filipino wife, Mary Chris, and then their beautiful son, Josiah, They've all been street preaching together and serving the Lord faithfully. So he's a very close friend of mine. The other Bible-believing pastor is uh, Pastor Tim Stevens right here from Lighthouse Baptist Church in Silk City. So I'd surely appreciate it if you can support him as well. Watch his videos. He's got great preaching. He's got a lot of wisdom, actually, a lot of intelligence, but it's just underestimated. A lot of people don't... A lot of Bible-believing preachers don't get the attention that they deserve, so I'd appreciate it if you can encourage him. Now, here's a Korean YouTube channel. This is uh, Bible Power 1611, and believe it or not, this person is my father. So my father, he's been in the ministry. He's been my mentor. He's been my pastor. He trained me a lot, and I became the man that I am today because of him. So if you're a Korean Bible believer, I'd highly recommend for you to listen and watch him. So for the Korean-speaking people. Now, there's a website called SermonAudio.com. If you go to SermonAudio.com, type down David Walker. And David Walker, he's the one who wrote the famous book, Rightly Dividing. And this man, he is one of the foremost authorities on dispensationalism. But here you can listen to all of his sermon audios. I've heard from some Bible-believing preachers that consider him to be the, the best preacher, actually. So Dr. David Walker doesn't know that, but there are some Bible-believing preachers who consider him to be the best preacher. So listen to his preaching, and you'll understand why. This one, Dr. David Peacock, he's considered to be one of the three, the top three, or the top two pillars of Bible-believing Christianity today. So ever since Dr. Rutland passed away, his mantle, his golden mantle, has been passed over to silver pillars, so to speak. This is one of the silver pillars. Dr. David Peacock, he runs the Bible Doctrine Institute. And this man is phenomenal, just completely phenomenal as a preacher. He is in demand everywhere among Bible-believing uh, Bible churches. Listen to him and you'll understand why. He's been also one of my mentors, so to speak. And he's been a great friend. And I really thank God for Dr. David Peacock. He helped me during my uh, troublesome times as well. Pastor Dennis Knowles, this man is also a great preacher as well. So he's a very close friend of mine. But listen to Pastor Dennis Knowles. He's located in Tennessee. But this man, he can preach. And his preaching will convict you. It will be a blessing to you. As a matter of fact, I, um, I remember at the KJV Jubilee that Dr. David Peacock had, he doesn't call on people twice, obviously, because there are so many preachers. But he called on Dennis Knowles twice. So it shows that how much of a great speaker Pastor Dennis Knowles must be. So you can listen to him. Now this one I recommend is called KJV1611.org. So let me type it, KJV1611.org. This is the website to buy Bible-believing materials. 
So I strongly recommend for everybody to buy it. Okay, this is not what KJV1611, sorry, KJV1611.org. And when you click on that, it has all the Bible-believing materials that you need right here. So this is the number one source that you want to go to. This is where I buy 90% of all my materials at. So go to this website right here. Now, he has a section right here called Free Downloads. When you go to Free Downloads, click on Theological Seminar. And what happens, you'll notice right here, is that every week or every month, they'll upload a new theological study teaching by the famous Dr. Peter S. Ruckman himself. So this is all free. So if I were you, I'd take advantage of downloading them because they go away within a month or within a week, something like that. But you can also go to this bookstore to buy everything that you need. This is the next website we recommend, www.chick.com. But this website is by the famous Jack Chick who produced these comic Chick tracks. This is the track that we pass out in Silicon Valley and San Francisco Bay Area. And 90 to 99% of the time people receive them. So this is the website that you can buy all your tracks from. We strongly recommend for you to go to this website. So Jack Chick and Dr. Peter S. Ruckman have been two of the largest pillars in the Bible believing uh, movement. They were the golden pillars and they passed away the same year. That's a coincidence. Oh, by the way, Trump became president that same year. So it's very significant time in our history that time. It's very interesting. I don't think it's a coincidence. But Jack Chick and Dr. Peter S. Ruckman were considered to be very close friends. Uh, the other one that I recommend is Final Fight Bible Radio. So www.finalfightbibleradio.com. Now I recommend this number one out of all the things that I recommended. The reason why is because this thing goes 24-7. Bible-believing preachers, Bible-believing clean music, mission reports, tips on soul winning, uh, hymns. I mean, it's got everything you need, even foreign stations right here. So I would strongly recommend to go to this website. You can even download it on your app. Just type down finalfightbibleradio.com. Pastor Matt Crane is the one, the tech host of this channel, and he'll also be preaching at our blowout. So this is all of our websites that we strongly recommend to you for a Bible-believing ministry. I hope that this will be a blessing to you. Please take advantage of them. Watch them. Please encourage these people. They are very underestimated. They don't get enough attention. Now, there's a lot of Bible-believing ministers and ministries that I did not recommend in this video because I, don't, I am not familiar with their ministries. If I knew about them, I'm sure that I would have recommended them. So that's also another reason why I probably did not mention them in this video. So I hope that you'll go to these people, be a blessing to them, and I hope that they will be a blessing to you. God bless your day.